Mr. Magaña, where are your glasses, sir? Your glasses. <laughs> <laughs> Don't have glasses today. Don't have glasses tonight. Hoy anda de civil, sin gas, sin without glasses, you know. <laughs> I mean, that's okay. That's okay. Um, so um, let's see what we have in here. All right, so good evening, everyone. Let's see what we have, uh, who we have tonight over here. I have Mr. Joseph Paris Rivas and also Elizabeth Gonzalez. So what's up, Jose? How are you doing, sir? Oh, he got disconnected. Mrs. Gonzalez. Hi. Hi, teacher. Hello. Hello. Just one quick, one quick reminder. Remember that tomorrow we have a class too. Okay. Ah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, be, because you have forgotten, right? Yeah. Uh, I forgot. Yeah, I mean, it, it's, it's going to be difficult for you and also for me because it's Friday but it's the last the last uh, class of the module so we gotta do our best for this so this is only the third day of the week for us so tomorrow is gonna be the last one so we're gonna say goodbye tomorrow you know goodbye for tomorrow <laughs> <laughs> so you see we've been a month over here already okay I finished the platform today. Nice. <laughs> nice. That's the edit. And uh, when, when, when is the deadline for you to finish the platform? Like when is the last day that you need to finish? Is it tomorrow or the weekend? Yeah, I don't really remember. You know, the deadline, la fecha limited. Deadline. Uh, we'll, we'll double check it over. Deadline? Here. Yeah, the deadline. Uh, Friday. It's Friday. So, it, so it's tomorrow. Tomorrow is the deadline for the platform. That's what you're saying. Yeah, I, I have to double check. You know, I have to double check right now just to make sure. But that's not the point. You know, that's not the reason why, you know, why you are here in class this evening, you know, tonight, the reason is to uh, practice your English, okay? Uh, so, tomorrow there are classes? Yeah, tomorrow we have classes because remember last Monday was uh, Dia de los Difuntos, so we didn't have a class and we need to have four classes in the week, all right? So this is the penultimate class and tomorrow we have the last class of the week and also the last class of the module so tomorrow my friends you finish intermediate in morning. class yes yes so we have class tomorrow okay. so remember please <laughs> okay nice um let me share the screen and let's start with the class that i have uh, prepared for you and uh, let me just go full screen and just go back in here. All right, so as usual, I have the phrase of the word of the evening or the phrase of, of tonight. And uh, that phrase is tonight, recharge one's battery. Okay, you can say recharge. All right, sorry about this. You can say uh, recharge my, recharge his, or their, etc. And this expression, as you see it in here, it's a literal translation. So if you say, uh, I'm, I'm tired, I need to go to sleep because I need to recharge my batteries. It's the same as in Spanish, recargar las baterías. All right. So tomorrow, Friday, it's the end of this class and the end of this module. And I would say it's the last time we're gonna see each other 
uh, in the in the next few weeks. But uh, you can say after the class is over, I'm gonna go to sleep and recharge my batteries. So this is the this is the expression for tonight, and uh, I have uh, an image to exemplify this idiom. Okay, so you see this gentleman, very chill, very relaxed, sitting on this uh, bench with no shirt and just with some shirts, and this lady talking to him, and he's drinking something over there. I don't know, maybe he's drinking water or con piquete, sin piquete. We don't know that, but uh, there's something wrong about this. I think he's supposed to be working, but now he's not working. <laughs> he's reading the newspaper. So what do you see here? What do you see here? Can somebody tell me what's wrong with this picture? ¿Qué tiene de malo esta esta imagen? You know, what's wrong with this picture? What's something wrong? Is is in his uh, work? <laughs> yeah. Correct. Okay. Yeah, he's supposed to be office. working, right? Excuse me? It's the office, but it's, uh -huh, it's, it's, uh, it's relaxed. On the beach. It's off. Uh, it's on the yeah, he thinks he thinks that he's in El Cuco, right? He thinks that he's in El Cuco, right? Or in <laughs> Yeah, that's that's the that's the, the theme over here. Maybe it's his lunch time, but he's He's taking it very easy, you know, too easy here. <laughs> and we have this this sentence here. It says, I have nothing against you. The lady is telling him, right? I have nothing against you recharging your batteries, but I think you should do it on your own time <laughs> because I'm paying you, you know. <laughs> like right now, I can tell you, you know, and that's not uh, ethical, you know. It's not ethical. So, uh, gentlemen and uh, ladies and gentlemen, go to the platform and let's try to complete some exercise. I, I don't think that's correct. So, but I think for you, after this class is over, you're going to recharge your batteries. Is that correct, Mr. Magana? Maybe you recharge your batteries reading, and I'm gonna ask you this question. Okay, so I'm gonna write a question in the chat right now in in Zoom. Okay, and the question is. What do you do to recharge your batteries? All right, that's the one. Did you get it? Yes? Yes. Thank you. Let me send this also to the uh, chat over here, to the personal chat. And just to start with this class, because you're supposed to practice your English, I'm going to divide you into pairs, okay? I'm going to split you in pairs. And what you're going to do is to, to uh, practice, ask and answer the question, what do you do to recharge your batteries? Maybe on, on a Sunday or on vacation, at lunchtime with your family. So share that with your classmates. I'm no, actually, I'm going to send you in groups of three, you know, groups of three, okay? Okay. There we go. So try to practice this, let's say for two minutes. That's it, two minutes, no more. Okay. So uh, David is with Joseph Perez and also with Raquel. Uh, Angel with Elizabeth and Patricia. Felipe is working with, with Iris and Rodrigo Eduardo with... Uh... All right, so go ahead, please. Okay. Okay, let me just look the chat. Your All right, so Mr. Felipe. And join the uh, rooms, please. Que hacer hoy, cuando no, no lleva tanto tiempo. No, sí. la misma mande. Sí, la misma mande. 
ya no estoy yendo datos ahí. Sí. <risa> ya no estoy yendo el teacher practiquemos <risa> pues okay what do you do recharge one by bat batteries your batteries 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 what what do you do I'm Elizabeth going to the mountain mm -hmm. <laughs> I walk in on, on the mountain okay oh go to the mountain walk 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 at the mountain walk 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 walk, walk. walk. okay i go to mm -hmm. uh, fish I, I like the no i don't i have very and i i i i have energy <laughs> <laughs> right, so let me ask. I'm sorry to interrupt you, uh, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, so, Raquel, what do you do okay. to recharge your batteries if you can uh, share with us? Okay, when I have a, a stress, a stress, I don't know if it's mm -hmm. good work, and I take a little cup of coffee and I I watch some some videos about music, etc. Like, or maybe um, I watch a movie. Okay, all right, okay, that's okay. So when you when you feel stressed, so that's what you do. Okay. Yes. Nice. What about you, Mr. Paris? What do you do if you can share uh, with us? <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, let me know. Let me think. In my case, uh, when I feel stressful, right? You know. I like to watch movies, if down popcorn, flour, nachos, Mexican food, rice, or soda, or ice cream. Things uh, about that. Remember my childhood, listen mm -hmm. to music, right? Okay. Enjoy the environment here in my city, right? The weather sometimes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Usually in these days has been raining, right? So, mm -hmm. but, it's good to it's, it's a good time to watch to watch movies, right? If you have the time. Yeah. Uh, maybe Mr. D David Magaña, maybe you read a book, right? Uh, to recharge your batteries. Is that my what case, you in my case? Uh, I search on YouTube things about books, right? Audio books, basically. Oh, okay. Or, I don't know how to say that in English. Which ones? Yeah. Reviews, 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 reviews. reviews. Yes, nice. Yeah, uh, you, you, you do a lot of things, Jose. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yes, Mr. Magaña, go ahead, please. Uh, I, I ride my motorcycle at sunset. Okay, nice. I, uh, yeah. It, 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 I enjoy that very well. And, and do, you ride the, well. do you ride the bicycle for a long distance or just a couple of blocks in your neighborhood? Or um, uh, I, I travel, I travel all, all country. Oh, really? Motorcycle, <laughs> motorcycle. It's a, motor, a motorcycle, motorcycle, you said. Oh, okay. Nice, no, like, like, yeah. like, 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 All right, so we're back and I see that we have uh, more uh, participants in this class. We have now Katia and uh, some more people joining the fan here. Okay. Now the plan for this evening is, is to finish the uh, practice of comparisons. You know, remember making comparisons with as and as. 
Like you can say this class is as interesting as the previous class you had yesterday. Okay. Or I can also say uh, Jose uh, Perez and Mr. Magana's uh, hobbies are as interesting as uh, Raquel, for example. All right. So this, this is uh, one way to use that grammar. Nice. Um, just one sec, come in here. Let me just uh, switch screens and just, all right, yeah, there we go. Just one sec, come in here. What is the structure, the answer? Okay, the structure is the one we studied, you know, talking about yesterday, all right? Hold on, please. And uh, let me just go back in here. For answer? Hold on. The structure is this one, sir. Look at this screen. So this is the structure, uh, the structure that we're studying right now. So if you're comparing two things like a, a house, a friend, a job, anything, okay, a, a, a drink, a water, beer, anything. So you can use this structure. For example, you have a car, you can say my car is as, and then as, as comfortable as yours. So all you gotta do is to put as, first and ask then and then and then the adjective in the middle and then as so that's that's it but if you're if you're using let's say another structure uh, like a noun like you say bedroom a uh, friend or something just like that we can use the next structure and uh, this one take a look so this is what we have okay. for tonight Okay, so this is what we have for tonight. So I'm gonna ask you, Mr. Uh, Felipe, if you're so kind, Mr. Felipe. Felipe Linares. All right, maybe you cannot hear us in here. Uh, so I'm gonna ask you then, uh, Jose Perez, I see that you have your camera on. Could you help me read these four examples, the one we have? Uh, I'm sorry, I'm late, and then there's plenty of food. Can you send me the information? Let's walk, please. So, Jose, okay. let's, yeah, thank you. I am sorry, I am late. I got here as fast as I could. Mm -hmm. There's plenty of food. You can have as much as you want. Can you send me the information as soon as possible, possible please? Let's walk. It's, it's just as quick as taking the bus. Okay. Thank you, uh, Jose. If, if I want to become uh, very formal to explain to you the grammar on these four sentences, all I got to say is in this case, we're talking about, so I'm sorry, I'm late. I got here and then you have this adjective or, or, the, or an adverb. But just think of this. Uh, you promised to do something and then you said, I'm gonna do it as fast as I can, or as, as fast as I get home. So the focus is as fast as. So you think of the examples in here. I'm gonna call you as fast as I get home. Okay, tan, tan rápido como llega a casa or, or something like that. So, and that's the structure you have as, and then in the middle you have another word and then you have as. Like in the second example you, you read, uh, Jose, there's plenty of food. You can have as much as you want because you're talking about food, tanto como quieras, you know, as much as, tanto como. That's the meaning of as much as. If you, if you say uh, pupusas, for example, you can say there are plenty of pupusas. You can have as many, as many as you want because we have, you can, you can grab one pupusas, two pupusas, three pupusas, etc. Okay, so that's the case. And uh, the next one, can you send me the information as soon as possible, please? Okay, a la brevedad posible. So that's what we're saying here, as soon as. As soon as we finish this class, you're gonna watch the news or you're gonna go to sleep or you're going to read a book or, or something, 
Okay, or you, as soon as this class finishes, you're going to recharge your batteries. That happens. Or you're going to, uh, I don't know, uh, brush your teeth, uh, your children's teeth, or something like that. The next one, let's walk, is just as quick as taking the bus. Okay? So my point tonight is to let you know that if you want to compare two things, you can use this grammar. In, in this case, uh, for example, if you go to, uh, to the movie theater and you go to Reforma or if you go to the other one, which is more expensive, you can say uh, Cinemark is twice as expensive as Cine Reforma, you can say, etc. But let's get to work. I'm going to split you in pairs, okay? And then you're going to practice this. Please do not write anything down. This activity is speaking, okay? So uh, let's say that I'm practicing with, uh, with Katia. So Katia, could you please un unmute your microphone? Yeah. Thank you. So uh, imagine that we're working together. We have from one to seven, and you don't have to go in order. You, I can ask you number three, you can ask me number five, et cetera. Or we can go one, two, three, just like that. So and let's I'm say- gonna, mm -hmm. I'm gonna give you the answer. Yes, so for example, if I read uh, number four, we are busy today, but we were busy yesterday. So you gotta use this structure, okay? Mm -hmm. That's option number one. But if you can think of another uh, structure to give me the same response or a similar response, go ahead. So no problem. So we are busy today, but we were busier yesterday. So that means that we are in as busy as busy as yesterday as yesterday correct yes in this case I, I i can say that that's the only option possible but on number two we have like two possible options or answers seeing a uh, same case on number three and then most of these sentences have more than one possible response okay okay all right thank you katia and um before I, I split you into purse, I'm going to um, send you the image right away. Now, just one thing, please give time, you know, to your partner to answer. So do not actually uh, ask and expect the response right away. So give some time, please. So no lo tiremos tanto a matar, por favor. So let me just one moment here. I'm getting this for you. Okay, so the uh, the image has been sent to you in the personal chat, and I'm I'm also going to send this to the meeting chat, and then you're gonna be divided into pairs. Okay, so just one sec. Come over here, and. Um, Two minutes. Yeah, you're gonna be practicing for this. Let's say, I think you're gonna take like three to uh, four minutes or more. Okay, so uh, you gotta be patient on this and and help your partner, please help your partner, you know, to to practice this. Okay, yeah, I sent that already. There you go. So I'm splitting you right now into pairs. So now you're gonna practice. Sure, but... The, the picture that you sent us is, is different. It's another example. On, it's okay. the, on the Zoom chat? Yeah, in WhatsApp chat. Um, but let's see. Um, you let sent just... us another example or exercise. Uh, yeah, you're right. I sent you number two. Yeah, correct. Uh, let's do the first one. Let me, let me uh, <laughs> send... The correct one, the thing is that tonight we're gonna be working on one or two exercises, but, but let me send you the correct one. Okay, sorry about that. Um, okay, I'm going to delete the first, the first one I sent, okay? 
There you go. They are supposed to have exercise one of 7.1. Is that the one you got this time? Could you please confirm, uh, Katia? Yes, teacher. All right. Thank you. So I'm going to send you uh, to work in person right now. So. All right, so go ahead, please. So David is with Elizabeth, Angel with Katia, Iris with Rodrigo, and Jose with Patricia, and Raquel is alone, but I'm gonna practice with you, all right? Hello, teacher. Hello, you're alone, right? <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> Yeah, you should blame you should be, blame your classmates because we don't have enough people in the house. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, yes, the things that you're only nine in this class right now, and supposedly you are like twenty. But uh, I mean, no problem either. Okay. Okay. So we're gonna go one by one. All right. So what about number two? Um, mm. Okay, and the number two is my salary isn't uh, high as as your as your as salary. Ay, no, 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 no sé. Okay, vaya. Solo acuérdese que tiene que poner el adjetivo en medio de los as as. That's it. All you got it. That's all you got it. Do. Okay. So this, okay. Uh, my salary is isn't mm -hmm. uh, high. As high. Is high uh, as um, as yours. That's as yours. Uh -huh, as yours. Only that. Only that. Yes. Uh, let's keep oh. it simple. Uh, so uh, Raquel, have you heard the uh, the expression? Less mm -hmm. is more. Less is more. Menos is más. <laughs> <laughs> okay. That applies, you know, to here. That applies here. That's why we say my salary isn't as high as yours. That's it. Uh, my salary isn't as, as high, high as, yours. as yours. Okay. Like okay, I'm going to okay. do number three, okay? <laughs> okay. <laughs> so, so we have, you know a bit about cars, but I know more. So you have to say you don't know, okay? Uh-huh. And then you go about cars, you can say about cars as much as I do. That's one option. You can also say you don't know about cars as much as much as me. Just like that. As much as me. As me. Yes. Okay. Just like that. Tanto como hey. yo. Mm -hmm. Hold on. Let me just you know uh, look look up something. Uh -huh. Felipe, Felipe is alone, so I'm going to send Felipe to you. <laughs> okay. Yeah, you're going to practice with Felipe now. This is room number five. I mean, I'm, continue, please, because he's, he's, still, uh, he's still out. Okay, number okay. four, we are busy today, but uh -huh. we were busier yesterday, so? Uh -huh. We aren't, we aren't, as, we aren't as busy. As yesterday. You got it. That's the way it is. This must be uh, easy, easier. <laughs> Correct. This is easier. Or you can yes. say this is this is much easier, but no problem. Ah, it's much easier. Okay. Yes, mucho más fácil or easier. Uh, number five. Uh, I still feel bad, but I felt a lot worse earlier. So I still feel bad, but I felt a lot worse earlier. So we can say, I don't feel mm -hmm. as, as bad as earlier. Just like that. <laughs> as earlier, okay. Yes, or as before, or as earlier in the morning. It's up to you. Or... Okay. Okay, the six here. Our neighbors have lived here for quite a long time, but we've lived here longer, our neighbors neighbors have haven't uh, live um, live as a long time uh-huh 
Mm, as a long time as uh, and, uh, I, no sé. <laughs> I see, no sé. uh, you can say that as my family or, or as me or, or as we it doesn't matter but uh, okay what about this option what about this option hear me out uh, our neighbors haven't lived okay haven't lived uh, as as much time as my family ah uh, okay as much time uh, okay uh -huh, yeah and then you can also say you can also say my our neighbors haven't lived as long as we just like that <laughs> very easy <laughs> yeah that's what i'm telling you you know less is more so do not complicate uh -huh. your life <laughs> It's my problem. <laughs> yeah, but we gotta be careful over here. Okay, yes. yes we, have, we have to keep it simple here. I'm going to assign, okay, okay. another classmate to you. <laughs> okay. So if Felipe didn't join, let's see what this one, if it actually joins. So now okay. it's my turn. It was a little nervous. Actually, I was a little nervous before the interview, but usually I'm a lot more nervous. Okay. This looks very complicated, but it's not actually. So I was a little nervous before the interview, but usually I'm a lot more nervous. So I wasn't, and then I just use the grammar as, and I just look at the adjective. It's, in this case, it's nervous. Uh -huh. so I'm, just go, I'm just gonna go, I wasn't as nervous as, uh -huh. and then I just use this. Um... Uh, All right. Uh, time. Before? No. Yeah, you know. can say. Uh, uh, yeah, uh, but as you can before. say as before. You may say. Okay. Yeah, you can say as before, or you can say as usual. Como, como, ah, hacer, okay. como se hacer, pues, usualmente. You say I wasn't as nervous as usually, just like that. <laughs> ah, okay, as usually. Pero también podía haber usado as before. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. The, you know, what matters in here is that you need to let the other person know like when, in this case, right? Because that's what matters. Nice. So I'm gonna close the breaker room. So we gotta go back, please. Okay. Hola. Ahorita me voy conectando. Hicieron algo ya? Sí. Practicando. Ah, es que ya está la principal. Yeah, everybody is ah. here. Everybody is here. Ah. <laughs> Ay, es que se me trabó mi computadora. Por eso no sé en qué están ahorita. Uh, that's okay. Uh, check the WhatsApp, please. That's what we did right now. Okay. Um, but this is the first practice, actually. So, and this is the first exercise. So, I'm going to ask... Let's see, um, since I have more activities for you tonight, you know, ready, please uh, tell me if you need help on any, uh, on any of these numbers, let's say number six, or number five, or number four, tell me please. Or I'm gonna, or I'm gonna ask you over here, um, number five, I still feel bad, but I felt a lot worse earlier. What would be the answer on this? What would be the the uh, the other option on this? Yes, can somebody uh, help us complete this number five? So the context is: I still feel bad. But I felt a lot but worse earlier. Uh-huh. Uh, uh huh. I don't feel. Uh huh. I don't feel bad. I don't feel. We gotta use this grammar, you remember. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. 
decir? I don't early. Be cold, teacher. Bad. I don't feel uh, as I don't bad. I feel earlier. Yeah, you can say that. I don't feel bad. I, I don't feel as bad as earlier. Just like that. As bad as earlier. So I'm going to give you the answers on this one, but I'm not going to write anything. The point is that you you're supposed to do them. Okay. So the number two is my salary is, is high, but yours is higher. So my salary isn't as high as yours. Number three, you know a bit about cars, but I know more. You you don't know as much about cars as me. So um. That's an option. Okay. Number four. Uh, we're busy today, but we were busy yesterday. So when? You got to think of when. Okay, we aren't as busy as yesterday, just like that. So remember, less is more, menos is más. Do not complicate your life, okay? <laughs> okay, so I still feel bad, but I felt a little worse, worse earlier. So I don't feel as bad as earlier. This one, this is a long sentence, but you see you're going to see this very reduced. So our neighbors have lived here for a qu for quite a long time, but we live here longer. So it's our neighbors haven't lived as much time as we, or as my family, or our neighbors haven't lived as long as we, just like that. Mm -hmm. And then, or as long as my family. So uh, I was I was a little nervous before the interview, but usually I'm a lot more nervous. Look, entonces esta, esta, esta persona siempre está nerviosa, ¿verdad? Entonces, we have, I wasn't as nervous as usually, just like that. Mm. So, I, I wasn't as nervous as usually. Lo importante es que después de la acción, vaya el, 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 el as, all right? And then, if there's an adjective, you gotta use the adjective. That's the key, ¿verdad? Esa es la clave, right? I wasn't as nervous, cuando? You know, I wasn't as nervous. So it has to go here, you know, when. I wasn't as nervous as, all right, as? Usually. As usually, just like that. Cuando se sentía, no se siente tan mal? As earlier, all right, when. Or mm -hmm. when, when are you busy or not too busy? Yesterday, yes. comparing when, all right. It wasn't and then, as nervous as usually. As usually, correct. And then this one, uh, you're talking about cars, so I say, I know about um, cars, yeah. you know, more than yeah. you, but we say, you don't know about cars as much as me. Okay, just like that. Yeah. Nice, but let's continue with this. I think we're gonna skip this because we don't have the time. Right now it's 9.41, but I'm just gonna send, I, I'm gonna send it to you in case you wanna practice and you, you can do this tomorrow, okay? All right, but we're gonna move forward with another exercise in here. So, um, let me just, just one second here. Um, so I'm gonna send this another exercise, but you don't have to do it right now. That's just optional if you wanna do it. It's the one that I sent, you know, by error before, but this one you don't have to do it, okay? Uh, because I have another one in here, this one, all right? Can you see the images in there I'm sharing with you? Yes. Okay, so uh, go to your browser and just go to google.com, please. And I'm going to show you what to do right now. This is going to be a conversation practice. And that's the idea right now, all right? And uh, let me just move a moment, please, over here. So go to get your cell phone. You can have your cell phone or your computer and you just type what I'm, what I'm going to tell you to do, please. Okay, so just one sec, come in here. And there we go. Okay, so just one moment, please. I'm getting this information right now. All right, there we go, I got it. All right, so you just go here, please, to this browser and just type in Tourist Destinations El Salvador. If you do it with capital letter El Salvador, it's actually much better, you know, but if you just do it just like this, no problem. Yeah, nombres propios necesitan ir con mayúscula, ¿verdad? Entonces, 
But in this case, just like this, you know, tourist destinations El Salvador. Can you do that, please? If you do that, you just click search or just click enter. You know how to do this. You're gonna get these results. On the uh, left hand corner of your screen, you, you're gonna see these images. San Salvador, Suchitoto, Lago de Cuatepeque, and Santa Ana. Just one problem in here. This picture, is wrong. O sea, que la gente que hizo esto puso una imagen equivocada. You know, it's, a, it's a wrong image of San Salvador. Maybe they got confused with Sa Salvador de Bahia in, in Brazil. But the other images and the other places are correct. All right? So all you gotta do is to click what it says, more destinations. And please let me know if you're able to do this. Me avisan, por favor, si les aparece la misma información. Please. All right? Were you able to do it? Oh no, tourist destinos El Salvador. Yeah, I, I sent I sent this to the chat. Así, verdad, para que lo ponga así como lo. Yo lo lo encontré, verdad. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm gonna send this to the uh, Zoom chat and let me know if you found. This. Did you find it? Yes, teacher. Nice, thank you. So click where it says more destinations in El Salvador. Okay, so let me just go back in here. All right, mm. on the main page, you just type in tourist destinations El Salvador. And the first result is more destinations in El Salvador. Click on there, it's a hyperlink. It's gonna take mm. you to this page. All right, and here you have a lot of options. As I said before, you have San Salvador, Suchitoto, Lago de Cuatepeque, but in here, you don't have to click on anything. Do not click on anything. You don't really need to click on this one, no. What I want you to do is to go to the, uh, to the right hand corner of your screen and you see this uh, bar, you just have to scroll down. Vamos a darle aquí, verdad? It end. So you have these places, San Salvador, Suchitoto, if you're already on this page, please let me know. Exactly, we have Santana, La Libertad, Concepción de Ataco. They say it's beautiful, wow. you know, Ataco is, is beautiful. <laughs> Huayua, Lago de Ilopango, Golfo Fonseca. Chill, okay. Yes, La Unión, El Sonte. That's why, that's why we have in here, uh, Adventure, architecture, art, beaches, ecotourism, museums, nature, outdoor. We have everything in there. Okay. And uh, and then we have, you know, travel guide, flights, hotels, etc. <laughs> so what you're going to do with your classmates for the next five minutes, at least, you're going to practice in groups of three. Okay. And you're going to tell, hey, you know, last year, I went to Suchitoto, or I don't know. I've never been to Lago de Cuatepeque. Quiero ir al Cuatepeque. <laughs> no, you can't say that. Or I went to Golfo de Fonseca, or I visited Huayua, or I'm from Huayua, you can say. I, I have a friend, you know, he's from Huayua, by the way. And then you can start making comparisons. You can say Lago de Cuatepeque is as beautiful as Lago de Ilopango. Or you can say, Lago de Cuatepeque is not as cheap as Lago de Ilopango. I know that Cuatepeque is more expensive, right? Mm -hmm. Etc. You can say Huayua City is as beautiful as Santa Ana City. Or you can say Santa Ana's Cathedral is as old as San Salvador's Cathedral. But you see my point over here? You can use any type of grammar, the past, the present, the future, comparison with more beautiful or better, more expensive or cheaper, or is uh, far, as farther than, you can say Cuatepeque Lake is farther than Ilopango Lake, you may, you may say that, right? But you get my point here, everyone? Okay, thank you. I'm going to uh, open the rooms again. And this time you'll be practicing in groups of three. And please, you know, try to practice. 
and you know share your experiences maybe you have been to these places you have more experience than me and your classmates and that's that's good that's the additive over here so david jose patricia and rodrigo you guys are together and then iris katia and raquel you also are together and then angel elizabeth and noria together because you have let's say until 9.55 or less to practice this. Please, join the rooms. Uh, okay, ahí está. ¿verdad? ¿Qué podemos decir de Santa Ana? I live in Santa Ana. Okay. Yes. Oh, no. uh, Santa Ana is... Oh. I visit I, I visit much uh, Concepción de Ataco. My family live in Concepción de Ataco. Oh, uh, beautiful in, place. In, so you should invite us, Angel. Invite us, please. <laughs> yes. <Yeah. laughs> yeah. I want uh, to Concepción de Ataco. Uh, yeah. Concepción de Ataco is cold. It's, it's cold, very right? cold. Yes. yes. So, Angel, Angel, have you been to the, Berlin? The, no. Is Guayuga, yes. Okay. I visit a gastronómico on Monday. Eh, no, on Sunday. Last Sunday? Weekend. Yes. Oh, last weekend. Oh, okay. Nice. It's beautiful. Yes. I have a friend he, who lives over there in Huayua. He's a teacher too. Ah, in, yeah. Okay. Your name I, is teacher. Yeah, I his name is. Yeah, Ta Planeta is. La Ruta de las Flores. Yeah, you're right. My favorite place. Told you say told. Told. Uh, told. Uh, but yeah, but in this case, Jose told is just for people. Uh, oh, I can yeah. say I can say uh, I am as told as my father or i am as tall as you jose but okay. for for uh, lakes or mountains or trees you say hi you know like when hi. like when uh, uh so snoop, when it's snoop dog you know is when it's smoking. yeah hi you know mountain. when it's when it's snoop dog <laughs> today is smoking the mountain that, like, yeah like it's it's big it's like <laughs> yeah excuse me patricia you say something <laughs> La expresión es, es tan como. Tanto como, tan como. Es tan right. yeah, caro es, es, como. Es, es tan alto, Por... tan caro, tan lejos, tan inteligente como. Ajá. Exactly, that's what we say. So, Jose wants to say, what, what do you want to say, Jose? Uh, uh, that I, I, I capable to say, Rodrigo, as tal as... Uh, as, as Patricia. Me or, or as Patricia. Patricia. Patricia is as. Mm -hmm. Yes, Patricia right. is as tall as, or Patricia is as smart as. Patricia is as beautiful as you can say. <laughs> you say it's not. <laughs> yeah, you may say it's, it's as short as my mom. You may say, or as my sister, or, or as my friend, right? It's short. <laughs> 
<laughs> but remember, if you're talking about uh, the the lake over here, in this case, we're talking about profundidad, right? Profundo. Uh -huh. so in this case, it has to be deep, uh -huh. you know, deep, you know. <laughs> deep, deep. Deep, yes. Uh, so re think of think of something like think of about the price. Think of the distance. So if you think like what you are, and I don't know Santa Ana. Who do you say? Uh -huh. Who do you say tan alto? Como? Uh, but but do you wanna say uh, Rodrigo about people or about places? The people. People, okay, you say tall, tall. Y the uh, otra forma? Uh, high, you say high. Sort of high. High, mm -hmm. yes, high. But teacher, yeah. some, some statements uh, say, say higher. Yeah, like but in comparative and comparative. And I yes, but in this case, I like yes, you may say you, I can you, do a mix with this. Mm -hmm. You can say uh, what you are city is higher than San Salvador city, higher because of course they have a, a, a or higher our altitude. Japan is higher, our Japan is higher as Santa Ana. Dan, 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 yes, because you're saying more, you know. But oh, in this okay, case, okay. but in this case, but in this case, we're saying that they are like the same. I can say uh, Lago de Cuatepeque is as beautiful expensive. but as expensive as as or no 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 I, I can say lago de lopango isn't as expensive as cuatepeque why because cuatepeque is very expensive right uh -huh. yes so that's uh -huh. the case yes yeah. no so you can no lo es exactly o sea usted uh -huh. puede decir lago de cuatepeque is more expensive than lago de lopango and that's okay but another way you can say lago de cuatepeque isn't as cheap as Lago de Lopango. Está diciendo lo mismo. Mm -hmm. So, and this is the point in here. And you so have. La libertad, uh, so, la libertad mm -hmm. isn't cheap as Lago de Cuatepeque, as. Isn't as, y luego pone el adjetivo, Jose, and then as. Ah, isn't okay. as cheap as. Mm -hmm. Isn't as cheap as. as. Exactly. Isn't as cheap as. El isn't es por el negativo, right? Yes. Una hora me llevó a entender esto. Yeah, but that's okay. Uh, but you understood now. Sí. <laughs> y aquí usted puede jugar con estas imágenes. Mire, tenemos es el sonte. Es una sonte. construcción, ¿verdad? Yes. We have el sonte, el cuco, everything. Uh -huh. We can compare el cuco. I can say el, el cuco. Yeah, you can compare countries. Aquí, it doesn't matter. You can say... Uh, the, 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 the Unión es beautiful. Yeah, you can say Belice is as small as El Salvador. Mm -hmm. Or we can also okay. say uh, El Salvador is not or isn't, you know, El Salvador isn't as developed as the United States. <laughs> yeah. No desarrollado, right? Okay. Or isn't as safe as the United States, some places, right? Like, and then you make the comparisons. Y aquí se va a dar the gusto estas imágenes. The economy, yes. Yes. Dan ganas de ir, ¿verdad? Por a eso aquí país. dice, mira, sí, aquí, pero aquí, aquí es, sí, va. No duermen aquí, ¿verdad? No duermen. Sí, dice, travel guy, flight and hotels. Es que esto es para turistas, pues están vendiendo. Uh -huh. Ajá, lo único que no es un lugar particular, there's no, like, specific place. Por eso aquí el que hizo esto se equivocó, puso esta imagen que no es del Salvador. Qué <risa> chido. <laughs> de Dubai. Yeah, Dubai en El Salvador. Yeah, yeah no, Bahía. No sé, know, pero no será know. Brasil eso, ¿no? Sí, Bahía, Bahía. Sí, I think it's Salvador Bahía, de Bahía. We speak Portuguese. <laughs> we speak Portuguese. In English. <laughs> Come visit us, right? Pueblos vivos. Pueblos vivos. Cosmopolis City. <laughs> yeah. The city that never sleeps, right? City of Campton, too, right, Jose? Yes. Also, New York City. Yeah, New York City, right? <laughs> nice. All right, so let's go yeah. back to the main station. It's almost time to mm -hmm. say goodbye. All right, please. But save this page, please. I mean, save this. 
All right. Si usted se quiere sentir como que ha ido a estos lugares, visit this page. Ok. Yeah. <laughs> All right. There we go. Vamos. All right. You know, the class is almost over, but it's not over yet. Okay, we still have uh, uh, around three more minutes. Un poco explotador el teacher, va, pero ahí vamos. There we go. Now you have the chance to feel like you're a tourist and to remember, okay, to remember the all good times before COVID-19. All right. So you have uh, these places, like if you want to go to San Salvador, like downtown, you have the National Palace, the Cathedral. If you want to go to the mountains, La Palma, or to the beaches, you have El Cuco, etc. All right. So save the information of, of that I shared with you. Guardenlo, verdad? Tesorenlo, and then you can actually practice this later on. So and. Uh, before we go, we're going to take a look at this, all right? At least for two minutes. Take a look at this image. In here, you can use any type of grammar. For example, if I, if I ask you, which is worse for your health, smoking or drinking? If you say the smoking, you gotta tell me why. But of course, you're going to practice with your classmates. You're not gonna practice with me. You're gonna practice with your classmate. And you don't have to go one by one. So you do the first one and then you say, oh, what about this one? Is it better to study English in class or online? Entonces, what you're gonna do is to ask and answer these questions with your classmates. And that's going to be the last activity for the evening, okay? So, no tienen que ir en orden, verdad? But at least choose the question that you wanna ask. You can ask which is harder math or english or you can say i think english is harder because, english. <laughs> right <laughs> so let's let's get back to practice please uh i'm gonna send you to work in groups of uh, actually in pairs in practice please all right all right yeah you have uh, i'm also going to send this image to you but right now teacher, join the... teacher perdón yo me tengo que salir no that's okay Gracias. Yeah, Good see night. you tomorrow. Good night. See you tomorrow. All right, so join join the uh, rooms, please, if you're still here. I'm going to send this to uh, the uh, personal chat, okay? I'm sending you on behalf of Joshua L. And she had a reservation with you for November the 12th, but the customer by mistake selected the wrong date. So if you could be told today, I will go. Please. All right, so we'll look at you. My name is Joshua. Katia, Katia. All right, so can you hear me, Katya? Hello. Hello, teacher. Now let's let's try to practice, please. Okay. Yes. If you like, I can ask you this question. Is it better to study English in class or online? You tell me yes or no, and then why, please. Okay. But you, you, I mean, think. But no, no <laughs> necesariamente <laughs> tienen que. I think practice. it's better. Um, mm, no. Yes, it's a good thing. Study English in class. Uh, uh, um, 
Presencia, presencial, ¿cómo se diría? Ya, ya, en... En clase. Este, in class. Uh -huh. um, online, mm, I feel is... Mm, uh, uh, Complica complicated. Complicated. Mm -hmm. Yes. For me. <laughs> yeah. I, I, I also I also agree with you. It's not the same because we human beings we need to uh, socialize. Okay, and it's yeah. not the same. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yes. It's it's important. Uh, uh, the communication. So, yes. Uh, exactly. Yeah. And right now yeah. we're just like robots, right? <laughs> Sometimes. Uh, online. Um, uh, uh, facilita? Facil facilita? Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. facilita? It makes it easier. Um, for, for, the, for the time mm -hmm. when... Uh, uh, Yeah, I'm sorry about that. Yeah, you were saying that the uh, online classes makes it easier because of the time, right? Elizabeth? Hola, hola. Es que me salió, yes. me salió, me, me salió. Oh, I'm sorry about that. Okay, so the class is over, uh, by the way, everyone. So remember, we have a class tomorrow and we're going to continue with these questions tomorrow. So, you know, I hope you don't miss the class tomorrow and you join so we can practice these questions, all right? You have very interesting questions over here, like which yeah. is harder, math or English? Uh, are you smarter than your parents? <laughs> you can say yes or not, right? Okay, etc. Et et all right. Okay. Thank you, teacher. So have a great night. I okay. hope to see you tomorrow. Okay. See you tomorrow. Good night. Have a good night, everyone. Good night. Good night. Good night, everyone. Good night, everyone. Good night, everyone. Good night, everyone. Good night, everyone.